guys, what is up? It's me. And today, yes, it's my birthday. Woo -woo. And I just summoned Ella. Ella, I'm fine. <laughs> so I decided to do a cool little mystery three marker drawing challenge. Actually, both kittens came, Ella and Raven. So here I am just grabbing all my markers that I just organized. <laughs> Yeah, so I didn't want to use all of my new markers because I already had so many. So I only took a couple of the newer ones. And yeah, there was a lot of varieties. But I'm going to be honest with you, I redid the markers because I got three of the same color. I'm not joking. I got three greens and I was like... Okay, I get at least one redo. So yeah, <laughs> you'll see that later. Uh, Raven is actually looking at me, waiting for me to do the pet. So I'm trying to record this. <laughs> yes, yes, hi, Raven. I don't know if you guys can hear her meowing. And then the markers were actually... I thought the lid was off right there, so that's why I was confused. So I want to apologize about the master scene right there. It is actually cleaned and organized. I did organize it after the video. And then, of course, Bailey wanted to come and see what I was doing. <laughs> yeah, so she started sniffing. And I didn't exactly have a bucket big enough for all these. Where you guys could see it. And all that. So I tried to use these, but they kept falling through the holes, so. And then, yeah, I tried to give it a good mix. Which is really hard to do because those one markers are really big. And then, of course, I have the show Little Baby Raven. And then there was Ella in the back. <laughs> Whenever I'm in my desk, she has to have pets. And then there was Ella, but Ella was a little far. So at this point, I uh, this is the second retake of this. I wanted to grab my markers. And yeah, I wanted to grab a big one. Because those are, like, obviously big. It's kind of hard not to pick it. And then, at the other, the other two were kind of hard to figure out what was which, so that's why I was showing the top and the bottom. So you could try to see the color before I did. And yeah, like I said, the first time I got three greens. So I wasn't mad about getting one green the second time. Because blue and green actually go pretty good together, and I do like that color combo. So I wasn't mad. The pink was a little weird, but I went with it. And here's Raven again for butt scratches. <laughs> of course you can't see that but you know and that was blue from the new kit and here's me showing off my uh stitch color changing mug if you guys didn't see me get those check out my tiktok a scholar would buy and here i am just set, sketching out everything i did zoom in and i did speed this part up a little bit because the video was just a little too long for me to narrate yeah, 17 minutes is pushing it for me. <laughs> Trying to come up with stuff to talk about. It's hard enough for 10 minutes. 17 minutes is just a little too much. <laughs> but So I actually went on to the website, or not a website, um, Google. And I googled birthday cake templates. And I saw this little template with the hearts and the circles. And I thought it was so cute. But then I know, yeah, I messed up here. They actually did like uh, circle squiggly lines as if it was a frosting like that. So then they had their cake like a circling, like the t like the top almost was like like a circle, kind of like how you see I'm doing right there. And I just thought that looked really stupid because there was a cake on top, and I was like, nope. So I'm <laughs> I erased it, and I just did my own thing. Wasn't using the template anymore, which is fine, really. It's really what you should do in the first place, anyways. But, yeah. So, I want to, if you guys don't know, this isn't a superstitious thing or anything, but I like the number three. I find it lucky. It's my number. So, I made a three-tier cake with three hearts and three circles with three candles. <laughs> and the candles were a lot of fun. And I'm going to apologize now. I know my hand was blocking the camera a lot. I tried to move it, but it was so hard because I'm right-handed. 
normally normally in this case i would have the camera on the opposite side so you could see but my laptop was charging while i was watching my show and it was on the right side so the camera had to be on the right side facing left so after i thought about it the pink actually worked out perfectly because of the hearts which i didn't think about until later but you know those were not intentional <laughs> And then I'm like, what? I might as well just make pink candles. So, at this point, I don't know what happened. Let me know if you guys know in the comments. I was trying to make yellow. Which is why I got all confused. That's why I showed you, like, that's why I held it up. Because blue and green make yellow. Right? Tell me if they don't, because I was pretty sure they did. Which is why I got confused right there. Now it's, like, this darker green. I was like, wait, what? And then, yeah. I'm just trying to explain that with hand motions. <laughs> yeah, so I got like really dark candles. So the reason why I wanted to do a birthday cake is because I'm having cupcakes for my birthday in about, uh, well, party's at six and it's about four right now. So I don't know. Let me know if you guys if ever happen to you. Whenever we make a cake, it literally sits in the back of the fridge until it gets moldy and then we throw it away. I don't know. We just, like, forget it exists. So, we decided to do cupcakes this year. So, hopefully they get eaten and they don't die. They were pretty good. I tried one last night when my mom was making them. Now, I did know from this point that I was going to allow myself to use either, like, a black marker or one of my outliners. So, that's why I was fine with the pink and pink on pink. Because, one, I didn't have that many options. And, two... I knew I could fix it later. So then I had to set what color cake I wanted. So I'm like, let me do the blue for the frosting. Keep it consistent. And then I will just make the cake green. Don't ask me what flavors they are. Because <laughs> I don't really like blueberry. So. Maybe it can be a cotton candy flavor. For the blue frosting. And then... Uh, green apple for the cake. Or something like that. <laughs> None of those gross flavors. And I, I know the color's a little iffy, but... From what I had to... Ha what, from the colors I had, I think I did alright. Let me know what you would have done. Or, but yet, yeah, you can duet it on... Oh, wait, no, you can't. Never mind. Never mind. Um, <laughs> yeah, just comment down below what you would like. Or what colors you would have put in where I and mean, if you want you can tag me on instagram if you want to take a picture uh that's skylar at five as well i am very thankful for all the gifts i have gotten i have a few more i'll open later tonight i do know what some of them are um <laughs> but yeah it's been a pretty good birthday of course i had to go to work but what else would I have been doing? My mom's at work. My class is in today. My new class starts tomorrow, so I didn't have any homework. I would have just been working on my blanket anyways. I still need to... That's what I'm going to do when I get off here. Just going to go work on the custom order. And then, So yeah, I just started with the black marker, but I didn't like how it looked. Like, the canvas, I don't know if it's just a marker or whatever. But it was kind of like... Almost like absorbing it. Keep in mind, these are the, the that is campus from the Dollar Tree, but yeah, it was like absorbing the green and the blue. I don't know if you guys could see it, but it was absorbing the black as well, almost. So I just went ahead and I went over it with the outliner, which you can see here. And yeah, I, I kept trying to move my hand out of the way, but I kept trying to like. Show you guys what I was doing. But yeah, I was probably should have just waited for my laptop to charge and put it on the lap then. But oh well. Say la vie. I th I think it turns out pretty cute. I don't know what I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but it still looks pretty nice. And yeah, I was showing you how that black marker was smudging on my hands. My clean hands. I just showered. <laughs> I literally just got out of the shower like an hour ago. So my, that's why I tried not to show my face too much. My hair was a mess. 
And yep, here it is. Let me know if you guys like